So some of the reaction, I don't know how many serious and how many just for controversy's sake, but some of the reactions online are of biblical proportions. What do you mean, biblical? What he means is Old Testament, Mr. Yes. Mayor. Real wrath of God type stuff. Exactly. Fire and brimstone coming down from the skies. Rivers and seas boiling. Forty years of darkness, earthquakes, volcanoes. The dead rising from the grave. Human sacrifice, dogs and cats living together. Mass hysteria. It's just kids for you. Yeah, it's Jeff. You. I've seen a lot of people saying it's more shocking how long the PBS kids show Arthur has been on the air and 22 seasons is amazing for any show and quite an accomplishment. But so is addressing important issues in a way that children can understand, teaching them acceptance of themselves and others, helping them navigate the ups and downs of childhood. I've never been a fan of Arthur, really, but I'd rather my kid watch Arthur than say Caillou since that kid is a disrespectful brat most of the time. Since Arthur has always tackled social issues, I don't see how covering this subject, same-sex marriage, is such a shock to some people. It is time in society to outgrow discrimination and judgment of people just for being themselves. You're uncomfortable with someone's sexuality? Great. Good for you. But that sounds more like a problem with yourself, not them. Also, if you are a person who doesn't watch or have children watching the program, why do you care what its characters are up to? The episode doesn't even show vows or the kiss or any of that. Just two men walking down the aisle. I kind of questioned why his students were invited to the wedding at all, but that's another story. There is nothing offensive in this episode, other than perhaps Biggie's outfit choice or Ratburn's dancing. But hubby Patrick No Last Name is looking fabulous. There was a student in 2005 with two mothers on the show as well, so this isn't the first time these issues were shown on the show. One of the characters at the wedding ceremony said, It's a brand new world. And I think that is a good commentary on current society for children. But also something many immature adults apparently need to learn now too. Your childhood is not ruined. Your dreams aren't crushed. Unless you had a crush on Ratburn, of course. So relax, would you people? It's a kid's cartoon, so it doesn't affect you. Fictional characters' sexuality doesn't affect you. But in fact, real people's lives don't affect you either. So those upset over this episode of Arthur should perhaps look in the mirror before judging others. PBS handled the whole subject respectfully and didn't push any political agenda in either direction. The writers of this episode deserve any of the praise people are giving them because even though it wasn't a huge deal, teaching children respect and fair treatment for everyone is a wonderful thing. Oh, that's hot. That's hot. Check me out on my streaming channel. Links down below. Also, if you could hit the thumbs and subscribe if you haven't, it would really help me out. Hey, on the news, on the news. The truth, entertain the to entertain you. Entertain you. Come and be informed and have some fun too. Fun too. There's only one thing that you gotta do. Tune in to Jeff you. Dream, look at true, that could true, that's just true.